at it in tonight's weather walk. Have you ever seen heat lightning? Yeah, I've seen heat lightning. What is it? Uh, okay. Lightning generated from too much heat in the air. What do you think causes heat lightning? The rain. Where would you want to go for your best chance to see heat lightning? Cincinnati. Why Cincinnati? Because we have a lot up there. I'm thinking maybe Arizona, because Arizona seems to have like heat. If you wanted to see heat lightning, where would you go? The clouds. How hot would it have to be to generate that lightning? Let's say 250 degrees Fahrenheit. Nice. So have you ever seen heat lightning? Probably have. Where have you been that it's been 250 degrees Fahrenheit? No, never mind. No, no, no. If you uh, had to tell me the sound that you hear after seeing heat lightning, what would that be? Crash. Boom. 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 How do you stay safe from heat lightning? Stay inside. Stay in the playroom. I try to keep cold. How do you stay safe from heat lightning? Uh, hydration, drinking water, and uh, she's eating the right foods. And she helped. Did you just say that he had to hydrate for heat lightning? I mean, are you kidding me? All right, here's the deal. Heat lightning. There's actually no such thing, believe it or not. If we have a thunderstorm, which is in close proximity to you, yeah, you're going to hear the thunder, right? But what if that storm was 10 miles or more away? You could still see the lightning because light travels a lot farther than sound, but you may not hear the thunder. So that's what most people assume is heat lightning. And the reason why we can't hear the sound is because of the bend of the earth and sound waves just don't travel through. I mean, there could be mountains, there could be uh, very humid air outside, which is typically the case. We usually see this uh, in the summer nighttime situation. But when you say there's heat lightning going on, it's actually just simply a thunderstorm off in the distance where you can't hear the thunder. Oh, and by the way, it's always a good idea to hydrate. Back to you. <laughs> yes, it is. Especially in August, especially if you're playing sports out it's, in the heat. Right, summertime. <laughs> a lot of hydration going on. We have a lot going on in the tropics. We're watching several areas. When we come back, we'll have your complete tropical update. And, of course, you can join our weather conversation with us on air, online, and on your phone. TWC Social is next.